Good morning, guys. It is 7 a.m. 7 a.m. Chores are done. Isn't that crazy? Last night was so super spooky. We had this crazy storm and everything got so eerie looking, like orange, like everything was on fire. Anyway, welcome to today's video. I'm gonna show you what I'm doing first thing in the morning. You guys know, so I told you guys yesterday that our pear tree, our beloved pear tree, um, Sam wrecked it. He cut the branches early in the season instead of letting them grow. So we have two pear trees. I don't know if you guys know that, but this one, let me show you, is covered by another tree or maybe even two trees. That spindly thing in the middle is the pear tree and then these are the other trees. So it doesn't get enough sun, but we do get pears on it. Let me show you. Like tons of pears. Do you guys see them up there? They're little. But Sam is dying for pear juice, so I thought I'll just pick some and bring them in and make pear juice. The dandy thing that Sam bought is awesome. The only problem is, is that I already picked all the ones on the low branches. But also, it's wet out here from the rain. Every time I pull some pears down, I get soaked. It's kind of creepy out here to be honest. I'll show you in a second all the ones that I got. This thing is like the king of, oops, stuck on a branch. This thing is the king of life though. Honestly, it's so good. All right, so these are all the ones that I picked. Oops. This thing that Sam bought is actually so sturdy. Like it's so strong. Anyway, these are the pears and they're not ripe. They're tiny, but I might be able to make some juice out of them. I'm gonna stick them in there because if you put ripe fruit with non-ripe fruit, then the non-ripe fruit will ripen. So that's my plan. I actually love having like fruit on our property even though we didn't get a lot of it this year because it's so much healthier for you. Sam is out doing horses, doing horse stuff, cleaning the barn, and I'm trying to get all of my inside chores done. I've been trying to get ready for Thanksgiving, you guys. It's almost Thanksgiving here in Canada. We have it earlier than America. We got this super cute little Halloween dress for little baby Lily. Isn't it so cute? Ghosts and kitties and it's orange. So I've been trying to uh, clean everything in the house like this whole weekend and this whole week to try and get it all ready so it's not last minute stuff that I have to do um, on the weekend because I like to enjoy my weekends. And these things are getting bigger by the minute and I can tell because they stink. Even though, oh my gosh, you guys ate that whole thing. I filled this up last night. What the heck? They scream if a quiet baby chick is a happy baby chick. If it's screaming and making noise, it means it needs something. So here's an update on the baby chicks. They're not super friendly, but they're nice and warm. You guys are warm. So cute. This is probably a girl. And then this is probably a boy because it's the cutest one and has a big dot on its head. Usually, Chickens with a big, certain breeds with a big dot on its head will be a boy, but nice and warm and fat. What do you think? I saw a comment where somebody said, don't let your cat look at the chickens, but it's good for the cat to have like stimulation like that. She can't get at them. They, they aren't afraid of her. Anyway, I'm gonna clean this out and then I'm going to give them some fresh food and water. I'll show you my favorite way to clean it out. I use like, uh, Dust pan, and then I just scoop. Whoops! I just scoop. Uh oh! Get down there, you little mister. All right, I'm just gonna finish this, and then I'll be back. It's actually freezing out today. Like freezing, like almost like winter. It's actually freezing, even in the coop. I think it's time to winterize this coop. I'm gonna have to do it on the weekend, maybe. I'm gonna have to get Sam to help me. We have to find. Like I'm gonna put plastic everywhere, like I usually do. It's the best way because then you're like really keeping the wind out. But look at this. Look, you guys. Shocking. 
One, all their shavings just keep falling through the little holes in the wood. And that's not going to keep them warm, so I need to get them warm. But look at them. Look at, they're almost as big as her. They had a huge growth spurt. Like, what the heck? I just showed you guys these chickens like two days ago. They're massive and adorable. I'm going to go get them some shavings. Actually, I'm going to have to get Sam to put something on here so that the shavings don't fall through because they're going to have to be warm. It's officially time to start winterizing everything. Sam actually wanted to order this stuff to put this like heavy plastic stuff to put in the uh, Molly to put in the doorway for the horses and maybe even for the goats because it keeps out wind and they can walk through it to go inside so i think i'm going to remind him about that I should, I should tell him right now to do that but i was able to give ellie a haircut her fall haircut come here ellie sit there it is her whole body see it she likes a whole body puppy clip she's so cute you're so cute you can tell that it's getting colder now because I used to get like 20 eggs, 23 eggs a day. And now I'm getting like 12. This might not be 12. 2, 4, 6, 8. This is only 10. The thing I hate most about winter, like most of all ever, in fact, the only reason I hate winter is because of water. We have to do water. Giving the chickens water, giving all the animals water. I like my feet are frozen right now because I spilled water all over me. Sam is at the doctor and I was doing the dishes and I looked outside and noticed this. Hopefully nobody's hurt. Uh-oh, I better go check because somebody's screeching. The guineas are all locked in the corner. They're stuck in the corner because they're afraid. Oh my gosh. I don't want to move it until he gets home because... <laughs> oh my gosh. Because... <laughs> Is there anybody under there? What's happening? Well, that didn't work, did it? It's okay. Let's see. It's heavy. Well, you can tell there's nobody there. It's okay. It's nothing scary. It's just our uh, chicken shelter. All right, I think everybody's okay. Holy moly. It's literally like a tornado out here though. So Sam, you need to fix that. <laughs> it's actually so quiet on the farm today, even the horses are inside. Because it's wild. It's wild. Ellie, what are you eating? All right. All right, do you guys want to try and wrangle this with me? No. It's gonna just take us flying. Oh my gosh, imagine. That'd be so fun. All of a sudden I look over and Gabby's flying through the air. You guys don't know, Gabby's so light. She's like light as a feather. You just breathe on her and she falls over. All right, here comes Sam. We are ready. Hey, Kirby. 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 Uh, yeah, I know it's going to be a parachute. Oh no, I'm so excited. <laughs> <laughs> Let Gabby on this end. <laughs> She'll take flight for sure. Wait, I have a question for you. <laughs> Did you have your phone in your pocket in the show? Yeah. Sophie, that is not okay. okay. Hey, Gabby, get up there. <laughs> Watch the dogs. Well, at least it didn't break. I've seen things break before. You want me to lift? Do you need me too? <laughs> Instant parachute. <laughs> oh my gosh. Ellie and Kirby get out of that water. I'm right at it. Look how beautiful it is out here. Okay. Yeah. Oh. I do not know what you're gonna do, but I trust you. Tie it so it doesn't fly. <laughs> If you tie it, does that mean that it'll like... You drop rope in the duck water. Yeah. <gasps> oh crap, that is slippery. If you tie it, does that mean the wind's going to take it and then like rip everything apart? Yeah. Are you sure? Oh, it's nice and 
I know. So, you, do you know where the plastic is? It is in the barn. What? Because yeah. we uh, gotta wrap the. It's in the goat, goat barn. barn. Oh yeah. We gotta wrap everything this weekend because it is cold. Girl, I'm resting this weekend. You're resting this weekend. Now we're gonna take Elizabeth and go someplace fun with the horses. Right. Um, I'm resting the rest of the weekend. So you're resting the west. You're say that five times fast. You're resting the west. You're resting the rest of the weekend. All right, well, I have faith in him. Some might not. <laughs> all the chickens are coming out now. They're like, yes, the wind is gone. They're all in the coop today. All I remember Bye, is the very second house Sam and I ever bought together. It was my favorite house that we've ever owned. And we had this amazing backyard and we had a deck and it had like walls around the deck. So we wanted privacy from the neighbors. So he built one wall with wood and lattice, built it really high up. Not super high, but built it high up. And it was so nice. And I loved it so much. I was so proud of him. And then like the next morning, <laughs> we woke up and it was all on the ground. Cause the wind came and the wind knocked it down. It was just like regular wind too. It wasn't like a big storm. We're all rushing inside because it's so cold. Like my hands are red. Remember when I said like, just love your life. Choose happiness. Choose to love your own life. If it's winter, just love it. Well, yeah, I was all braggy, but it's I was wrong. You guys, I freaking hate winter. Uh-oh, there goes Posey. Uh-oh, shoot. Yeah, don't listen to me. <laughs> I'm so cold. And the goats just bro Dude, broke in. Dude. They just broke in. Oh no, Lola, 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 come on, come on, pretty girl. Oh my gosh, like it's so bad. Lola, why are you causing trouble? It was you. <laughs> no, they all burst in. Okay, so it is that time of year again? <laughs> it's winter time. And you know what that means? It means that it's almost Halloween. And that means Halloween dressing up for our horses. But I need help. I need help because what do you want Lady to be? Ladybug. You like to be cat noir? A ladybug. You want to be cat noir. What the heck is ladybug cat? Ladybug and cat noir. Like what is that? Like I know. The miraculous ladybug. The miraculous ladybug. Comment below if you know what she's talking about. But I don't know how there's a ladybug involved. I know. Marinette and I forget the other. You can't remember I anything in school, but you can remember these characters from years ago. No, we watched it recently. Marinette turns into Ladybug. When, um... All right, so the whole point here is that I need to figure out how to make a lady into a ladybug. So I was at the store the other day and I saw like a baby's costume that was made out of a ladybug and I kind of have an idea how to make it, but. Let's get a red slinky and spray. No, a black one, and then. Isn't it? I don't know, but anyways, I need help. How, to, how am I supposed to make lady into a ladybug? That's what I need help with. Like, I'm not creative in that way. She's already kind of red, but she's got spots on her. She's black, I'm gonna put red spots on her. That's people, no. no, people, I saw, I saw a shoe like We're that. not doing that. All right, well anyway, comment below and tell me what the heck, how am I supposed to make lady into a ladybug? And then how does Sophie tie into like riding on, being on the back of a ladybug? I could be cat noir. I could be a fairy. I don't know, we need help. The other day I had this dream bro. and- Hey, bro. <laughs> Sophie likes to go through the door before me bro. so she doesn't have to close it. But the other day I had this dream that we were living in a different house and we didn't have this amazing chain link fence and all of our animals got out. I'm talking like every animal, all the dogs. <laughs> Don't talk about that in front of her. <laughs> all the horses and ladies like, what? And they were running wild and because they're so friendly, they were running up to everybody. Like, like little Posey was running up to people, wagging her tail, I was so excited. Everybody was freaking out because they weren't used to like farm animals being so friendly. Storm looks like a demon. Look at him. He's like all black. There's a black shadow there. Yeah, well, it's freezing. <laughs> Look at the cat. Like, freezing. Here? 
Yeah. Anyway, that is it for today's video. We are trying to plan some big, we have like another show still, and we're trying to plan like a big summer finale, which I'm really excited about. We're talking with friends. Summer's gone. Summer's gone. Oh man, it's awful. But anyway, comment below how you think I should make Lady into a ladybug and how to tie Sophie's costume into that. Like honestly, I can't stand it anymore. I'm so cold. Like my whole body is frozen. I'm not acclimatized. She's not acclimatized either. Yeah, she's got her hair, her fur all puffed up. The ducks are like, this is nice. Oh, all right. Let these babies out. So we just open the door each night. That's Do you see any more favorite. eggs? That rooster right there is my favorite. And Do you see any more one. eggs? No. Woo! Wow, when he, <laughs> he's big. See, we knew it wasn't your turkey in the freezer. Yeah. <laughs> Sophie, wow. that turkey, that rooster might. So, <laughs> Sophie, come here. Wow. Whoa. I am not One of our roosters anymore. sometimes gets grouchy because and will ch chase me. But look at how big he is. Like, things have changed. I'm not being chased by a rooster. Wow, I got nothing for you guys. You're so big. Just let me pet you. Just one pet. <laughs> Don't you know?